Hi everyone, so I sorted out Sienna's toys in the living room the other day. I got some new boxes, um, kind of storage for them. So I thought, I thought I would show you. Sienna is in the background if you can hear her. She's trying to play with daddy. Um, so yeah, I thought I would show you how I kind of store her toys downstairs. She doesn't have a lot down here. Whisper. Yeah. Go on then, go and whisper to daddy while mummy makes a quick video. So yeah, I thought I would just show you how I store her toys downstairs because it might be helpful for some reason. Um, so normally here, you can see she's got her dolly's potty there. Normally her two dollies will sit kind of next to the potty um, and just kind of stay there because they don't fit in the boxes and she plays with them all the time at the moment so they're always down here. Um, the boxes by the way are from wayfair.co.uk and there's a big, a medium and a small for Sienna's toys because I find if she has too many down here she doesn't really know what to play with she just pulls them all out whereas with this we can kind of decide what we want to get and kind of play with that and keep it more organised. So, in the big one, we basically have her bigger toys. So we've got her shopping basket with all of her kind of plastic um, fruit in and spoons and just kind of like, um, there's a few wooden bits in here that have come down from upstairs as well. But basically that's kind of her shopping and food kind of toys in there. There's a few bracelets in here because she loves dressing up at the moment, so they're just in here randomly. A few other little toys like her um, tambourine and one rabbit because she wouldn't put it upstairs. Um, so there's just one cuddly toy here. She's also got this. She got this for her first birthday. I can't remember who got it for her, but it's absolutely brilliant. It's like a... My toy. Yeah, in a minute, darling. Mummy's just way. showing the camera. Can you, come this way? you can have it in a minute. You can no. take it to Daddy, yeah? Well, so it's basically a shape sorter in the kind of shape of a farmhouse. So at the front here, it's got three kind of farm shapes, and they're a bit more tricky than your average um, kind of regular shapes like circles and triangles they're a little bit more tricky so they're good as she gets older and also you have the keys let me just find one there's three different keys that goes with it as well and they kind of fit in there so again it's kind of shape sorting but it's for quite slightly older so yeah that's a really good toy then she's got her in the night garden i don't actually know what this is called but it's basically you pull it up and there's a mirror and there's all different little buttons and you can have it on just playing music which she had when she was younger um there's also a quiz mode so it will ask her to find iggle piggle find the yellow button find the drum things like that so it's a bit more educational as well now she's a bit older so that one's quite good as well um a few other little random toys little cups She's got her eggs as well, we love these, doing colours and shapes and just playing with them. And then she's got her jumping Peppa Pig in the bottom there as well that we sometimes get out and play with. And where's Minnie? And then she's got this mini as well which plays music and counts and everything like that, it's really good. And she just kind of sits on the top as well. So that's what's in that one. In the middle one we've basically just... just Soft toys, her soft handbags, makeup bag, just basically anything soft. There is a few toys that have got mixed in, like her camera, that should be in the other box, but it doesn't really matter. And then there's this little chair that I got from the charity shop, and she just loves this with her dollies and teddies, and she just sits them on it and My feeds daddy. them. And there's also a few soft balls in here as well so yeah this is basically full of soft toys and then in the small one it's basically just a few books that she loves uh, mainly learning books i keep downstairs story books and more upstairs for um bedtime yeah she absolutely loves these that's not my whatever books fairy and dolly she's got they're her favorites at the moment she basically knows them off by heart and she sits and says the words by herself um and then she's just, she has got some other like little story ones like these. And then she's got some more learning ones there. So first hundred things that go, first hundred words. 
um, and sometimes we'll just pull a book out and just go through it and learn things. Um, then on the top she's got a few magazines, she loves the Peppa Pig magazine. Oh and Dolly's nappy is in there, that'll go over there. And then right on the top we've just got her Peppa Pig Aqua Doodle which is from BB's Baby Store. I will link it down below if you want to get them, they're absolutely brilliant. We use this a lot, we just pull it out and do numbers and letters and um, she recognises her name now and I think that's from having this we've been writing her name and telling her that that says Sienna and now she can recognise it herself so that's been really great comes with a little pen it's all water so it's completely mess free um, and then just dries clear again and you reuse it it's just brilliant it's no mess drawing basically and learning so we love that so that's what's in the boxes and they're right next to the living room door that we don't actually close because we have the stair gate to keep Sienna out of the kitchen. Um, so behind the door I actually have a few of her bigger toys that she likes to have downstairs. So she's actually got her princess hammer that she won at the fair the other night so that's just behind here. And also her wand that she got at the fair. It just lights up when you press the button like that and flashes and she's been loving that since the carnival so that's just behind the door as well. Then she's got her hobby horse. This is the same as her beloved rainbow, um, just obviously bigger and on a hobby horse. She loves playing with this as well. Sometimes we both play with this and run around the living room. So that's there. Then she's got her wiggly snake and then she's got her pop-up tunnel. Sorry, the light's really bad behind the door. Then she's got her pop-up tunnel that's just behind the door because she loves to get that out as well and just crawl through it and put her balls through it and put her teddies through it and everything so we keep that folded there and she'll pull it out and undo it whenever she wants she can do that herself so that is pretty much all of Sienna's kind of toys downstairs it's all pretty compact and organized which I'm happy about at the moment she has got her Peppa Pig chair over here it's not much of a toy though and we have got this monkey thing here but she's not too keen on it I'm actually looking to sell it I wouldn't really recommend it for Sienna's age it might be good for kind of six months and they're learning to kind of put the balls in the top but it's not great for Sienna's age so yeah pretty much her toys are just over in this little area it still fits in with the theme of my living room but obviously she needs toys downstairs so I just find this a better way of doing it so I hope you enjoyed this, I hope it was somewhat helpful and thanks for watching, bye! Ow!